Slice Technologies is the provider of Slice, a free-to-use purchase and package tracking app. The company also operates a market research business that makes use of online purchase history. Today, we're introducing you to their market research service, Slice Intelligence. Slice Intelligence was launched in July 2014 as a market research service for analyzing e-receipts. Based on this data, Slice publishes press releases on the sales status of popular products for which the service has become well known. The press release on the sales status of the Apple Watch attracted considerable attention. The survey results announced on April 20th revealed that 62% of all Apple Watches that went on sale were sold within the first hour of the first day of pre-sales. Moreover, by analyzing the data on e-receipts, Slice is able to collect and catalog all data on the delivery status of products after they have been purchased. The survey report announced on May 20th revealed that only 48% of people who had bought Apple Watches during pre-sales had received their watches. They also announced the results of a survey on the online sales of costumes during last year's Halloween season. Costumes of Elsa, the heroine from the hit movie Frozen, made up more than 30% of all sales of costumes for women and children, while costumes of Anna, another character, made up 10%. Slice Intelligence has been creating a buzz with their publications of sales trends on acclaimed character products. When iPhone 6 went on sale last year, they announced the relative rates of sales among the different carriers in the first week of sales. This graph reveals that sales made through AT&T were way ahead of the rest. Meanwhile, sales made through Sprint were way behind the crowd. Unlike the sales ranking charts provided by companies for their own products, Slice Intelligence is able to ascertain the shopping behaviors of users on multiple online shopping sites. In other words, it is able to instantaneously ascertain sales trends within the entire market for which it has become the focal point of the media. Could you go into detail on the response the press has had to the Slice Intelligence press releases? Well, we've received extremely good feedback from the press. Uh, the breadth of our data is immense and the stories that we can tell are so innovative that the media frequently reaches out to our team first to get the most detailed information on current events. This has been a great way for us to attract new clients. How has the media coverage impacted your experience with Slice? It's really exciting uh, being able to see the research we conduct here at Slice featured in top outlets such as Forbes, Business Insider, and Reuters motivates us to continue to innovate and collaborate to look to the future. What we're doing is really fun, constantly trying to beat our previous best, and we ultimately want to have our analysis act as the voice of the market. Slice Technologies is based in Palo Alto, California in the U.S., just south of San Francisco and part of Silicon Valley. Palo Alto is well known for its tech hub. Slice started as a research project at Stanford University with a goal to add structure to unstructured data. They found the inbox to be most in need of structuring and that the service around e-commerce could be improved. They realized that by accessing the inbox and mining the data from billions of receipts, they could, in fact, grasp the overall trends of e-commerce. The company was founded in 2010, and the first Slice web app was released in October of that year, with mobile apps following a month later. In July 2014, the company launched its market research business, Slice Intelligence. Slice joined Rakuten Group in August 2014, and then acquired Unroll.me in November 2014. We can look forward to the insights gained from the synergy created between Slice, a unique market research service, and the Rakuten Group, which operates a diverse range of businesses.